to my tour from my house. Well, let's turn over and let you actually see the house first. This is the house from a distance. As you can see my garden. So let's start the garden. In the garden I've got a range of different things. Lots of chickens, some sheep, villagers, pigs and cows and some other little things. And some squids in there and cows in the water. Anyway, let's start the tour with the actual house. And I'll tell you what that is in a minute. Let's open the door. When you come in my house, there's a couple of steps and a dog. <laughs> and another dog. Well, they're actually wolves, but we're going to use them as dogs. Anyway, this is the sitting room. So I can just chillax, put some cakes on there, and eat. In here is the kitchen. Some books, for like cooking books, whatever. And if I come up here, a nice bunker to sit on and eat. Furnace, crafting table furnace, crafting table. And a fridge that actually works, because if I press this button, I get something lovely. I'll tell you how to do that. Get a dispenser, just fill it up basically, and then cover it back up, which I'm just about to do once we get some more wood. As you can see, cover it up, and we'll have a little fridge, cake, and just some tables. Add a nice little window to look in, and another little window here. So let's go out the kitchen. Um, as you can see, I like my wolves slash dogs. Then here's the basement, so which I'm going to show you later. Um, so let's go upstairs. Upstairs, I've got a glass roof with a kind of wooden um, bunker in the middle. This is meant to be a rug. Some people think it is, some people think it's not. Lots of things that have all been collected on um, survival mode. I did not just take these from the inver inventory. Um, I did take these from the inventory on creative mode, but I, um, I made this fire um, using the create, um, you know, mode. Anyway, let's take you into my bedroom. Lovely little bedroom, little lamp here my things and my dog likes to um, sit in my bed well my other beds chest here just for the things that i collect every day and i've only just started i've ne i've only started playing um last night so anyhow let's go out this door and we come to the balcony the balcony is not really interesting, it's just got seats and a table. But I like it because you can see everything. It's got a little pool down there that you can see. And I'll show you what that path means later. Anyhow, let's just skip going out through the doors. Let's see this. Let's go up and up and up. Welcome to my tree house that I just built about five seconds ago, just before this video was made. Um, as you can see, where's I do have two dogs, well, wolves in here, but one's escaped, I think. Anyway, um, this is where I store most of my Halloween stuff, and these are just lights, so when it gets dark, I use them as lights. But you'll be using these pretty soon because it's going to be Halloween soon. So let's go out. Whee! Um, it's actually almost done. I'll just take you over to the back with this path. Now I use this as a kind of guidance. So come along here. Doo -doo -doo. And this is really, really important part of Minecraft. It's how I kill some animals if they're down here. Push them into the lava, they die. 
I jump in on creative mode and done. And I get the beads and whatnot. And if they're annoying you, all you have to do is push them into the lab. It's also good for traps, whatnot. And also, it gets quite cold around here because it's near snow, so and this keeps the whole area warm, you could say. It does. Anyway, that's basically it done, but I've got one more thing to show you. Now, I don't know if this, is, if this will work because I've not tried it yet. So, I'll do this. Um, put a car. Put that there, and all the stuff that I don't want, I'll just throw in. This is just for example. Just for example. Press this button, and it won't go. Yep, it, it will, it will. As it gets stuck, and I haven't noticed that, because I've never tried it out before in my life. Because I only just built it a couple of minutes ago. Um, yeah, um, I was a bit worried about the corners because there's quite a lot of corners, so I just come around here and keep pushing it and it will work. And I don't know how that one got there. I've obviously not tried it out because it's done. And then there, and the next time you come for water in a bucket or something, you realise that destroy it. Simple as. And you get all the stuff out of it um, that you can just either leave or collect if you decide you need it. Oh no, my little dog's dying. Anyhow, I said I was going to show you the basement after. So let's go to the basement. This is just for rain cover kind of thing, just for a show. So, basement. I've got a couple of dogs down the basement. Well, wolves down the basement. I'll shut that because I don't want the wolves that are um, up on the surface getting down here. So, they're normally waiting for me to welcome me down. So, let's see if they're still. Yep, they are welcoming me. If I come along here, welcome to my laboratory. Laboratory? <laughs> Some cauldrons that I have no idea what to do with. I'm going to fill them with water. I've experimented about, well, one potion, but it's not exactly working. This is for the wolves. See, I've got some people to look after them. And um, what will happen is they can get through there and it's just for a fact of keeping them there. That's a box of potions. And this is just diamond armour in case you get lost, compass, whatnot. And I think, I think, there's a cart here already, but let's see if it works. This I have already tried, and it does work, it's just a bit slow sometimes. Is there a cart here? Because I think I've left the cart. Yep, I have. Oh my. Oh my god. Wait. I'm just going to abandon it. Okay, the dog's got in it. Or the wolf, and that is actually a dog. See, Becca, there's the dogs. Anyway, I'm going to leave these dogs and get on with my turn. Anyway, um, I need your help because I'm not quite sure what to do from here. I, I'm going to make like a storage room and a couple of other things like. Um, in my laboratory I'm going to extend it to make it bigger and do like traps and experiments and whatnot, not just potions. Uh, but I need your help. Should I make a village or what should I do? Should I make some tunnels, train tracks, whatnot? Anyway, hope that you enjoyed my tour of my newly built house. Uh, yeah, hope you enjoy it. So, that's it. And it's practically a whole Minecraft day to do this.